Hi guys, so today I am coming at you from my new place. I have officially bought my own place. I finally found somewhere, I got it, everything's done, I'm blooming in it. What? This incredible room that you see here. It's just so wonderful. Got a bubble tea, ready to update you on everything. Well, this is actually my first ever bubble tea like out and about, I've made them at home, but this is like a proper one like from a place. Hmm, oh God, it's so much better than when I made it. <laughs> but yeah, I'm sat on the floor. I've got no furniture. <laughs> and I'm, I'm actually doing the place out before I move in. So I haven't actually moved in yet. Um, I've got the keys. I'm trying to like get all the people in place to do the work. So, oh my God, there's so much to tell you. So I'm having the kitchen completely redone. I'm having all of the flooring redone apart from the carpeted rooms, because they're totally fine. The walls have just been painted. I think they've, they've got one more coat to go, but um, they are all being painted like a white color. So yeah, new kitchen, new bathrooms, and then I'm sending to buy furniture for everything. So bed, wardrobes, desks, sofa, television, like everything. Once the work's been done though, I can move straight in and I'm so excited about that. So I'm trying to get things done like as quickly as possible so I can get in because I'm so excited you guys, I'm so excited. And you know, the whole drama of like me losing out on the other players and da da da, and the whole everything happens for a reason thing is definitely the case of this place because firstly, silent. There is, there is nothing around, like ASMR filming wise, it is just, then in terms of the actual plays, I've got great space. This room that we're in right now is actually gonna be my studio, my filming studio. So this is gonna have like desks set up and all my filming props and everything. And like on this wall will probably be the green screen or something. So I'm gonna give you a little low down tour, but the, the, the tour's gonna be a bit of a mess because there's everything's been stripped out. So there's no kitchen, everything's been stripped out already by my legend of a dad who, who's helping me save money by ripping everything out for me. But yeah, so the only rooms that are like done are this room, the studio, dark. I'm not really doing anything to it and they've just been, the wall's just been painted. And my bedroom, I'm not really doing anything to it because it's just a room and it's got carpet and it's just jazzy. It's a bit of a strange tour as well because I've got to be careful not to show you too much and have recognisable things in shot of things. So I'm going to be careful like safety wise, so no windows, do you know what I'm saying? But the windows are so cool, but it's fine. Safety first, my friends, safety first. Okay, hang on, slurp the bubble tea and I'll take care. So I mean this is the bedroom but we've got loads of stuff everywhere. There's actually a built-in wardrobe which is really handy dandy um, but I'm gonna get some more wardrobes as well which are gonna go here at the end of the bed. This is there's an ensuite bathroom so there's one bathroom here um, which I won't bother showing you. I'm go I want to show everything in detail like the bathrooms and stuff but there's things that might be recognizable if people were to try and stalk me so I'm just gonna be careful you know. I hope you understand. <laughs> but this is the hallway which I'm getting grey flooring put in on everything and I'm getting spotlights put in. Let me turn the lights on actually. So yeah, this is this is the hallway that I'm gonna get redone and there's just like different cupboards and stuff and then that's the studio and that's the bedroom. Then there's another bathroom here. So there's one like main bathroom and then there's the ensuite bathroom for the, for the bedroom. So we were just standing there and you walk in and this is the living room. So this is where I've marked out to put my sofa. I'm gonna put a TV here. Um, and it's quite a small room. The, the kitchen is actually going to be here. So it's like an open plan kitchen to living room space. And obviously there's no kitchen at all right now. There's just absolutely nothing there. <laughs> um, and there's four spotlights and this is going to be taken out. And I'm going to be putting spotlights dotted across the ceiling in here as well. And there's a nice big window here. I'm really excited about the open plan living. Like, because it's, it's quite a small room. And at first I was worried about that, but then I thought, there's nothing better than like being in like a really cozy room on the sofa with blankets and being able to access the kitchen right next to it. Blooming great, cup of tea's instant. Literally walk from the sofa to the kettle. There is also one more room which I can't show you, but it's a little tiny gaming room. Like I'm gonna set it up as a gaming room. It's just a little extra room, like a very small room, which I'm going to put desk in or two desks and have computer set up and stuff and crafty set up. One crafty set up, one gaming set up. In there which is really cool and the last thing is that there's actually a balcony which is really cool because i didn't have one in the other place that i was looking at and it's really cute and i thought like the balcony's gonna be so cute to like sit outside and have a cup of tea and stuff i'm just on this like, yeah. 
Yeah, as I say, I can't show you much right now, but once it's all redone, I can show you pretty much everything because then it will be all my own style and it won't be recognisable to anything that was already there, if that makes sense. So I'm excited to show you once it's all done and I'm excited for it to all be done in general. I think this bubble tea has a lot of sugar in because I feel very hyper. In terms of decorating the place, the style I'm going for is I'm getting like all of the actual stuff I'm going quite plain, so like grey flooring, white kitchen, grey worktop and like a light grey sofa, just very plain because I'm going to go chaotic with the accessories. So like, let me give you a little example because I'm so hyped, right? Because I've already started ordering stuff because I'm like that. All of my kitchen stuff is purple, like purple microwave, pastel, I mean like pastel retro purple, you know? And I've got purple microwave, purple bin, purple, purple kettle, just purple everything, right? Which is just gonna stand out so cool than that, add some colour. Okay, firstly, I need to talk to you about the rug that I got. And I think I'm gonna put it in the hallway, you know, this long hallway here. I think I might put it in there, but I'm not 100% sure. I bought this rug and this was like a treat myself rug because it's like my dream rug in the whole of the universe. And Lazy Oath is like my favorite brand. Like I'm literally wearing Lazy Oath boots right now. These boots are like my favorite thing. They've got heart buckles on them. Um, like, stop it. These are like the best. Anyway, Lazy Oath is like my favorite brand ever. And I had this rug, okay? I'm gonna put it on screen right now. Put it here. It's a blooming bear rug that's lying down. <laughs> I'm in love with it. I'm very excited. I think it's gonna make the place look really fun. And I'm, the vibe I want to go for is just like this fun but modern but fun. Then I'll show I'll show you some other things that I've ordered. So I've ordered so I ordered this lamp which I'm in love with. This is gonna go. It's a big floor lamp. It's gonna go in the living room. I think near the TV like the sofa TV area. And it's a blooming tulip. It's a giant tulip lamp. I'll link everything in the description in case you're interested and want to be nosy or want to whatever. But I'm in love with the lamp. I love lamp. Then I also, one last thing that I ordered recently was a art print from like my favorite artist who's called David Shrigley. And he makes these like doodle, artwork of just like random things in his brain and I just love the way he thinks, the weird style of like painting or drawing and ugh. anyway I've always wanted one of his prints and I thought this is the perfect occasion because I could put it on the wall somewhere in the apartment. I found this one, I went through his website and I was looking through them all, I found this one that's like my favourite thing in the whole universe. It's a blooming frog with a frog butt. Frog butt cheeks, you know what I'm saying? It's not the best thing. I was about to look at it. Isn't this just so good? <laughs> but yeah, I'm, I'm really, I don't know where I'm gonna put it in like the living room or the hall or the studio or the bedroom, I have no idea, but I'm in love with the frog with the butt. But yeah, I think buying the accessories and stuff is gonna be like the most fun bit. Like at the minute it's a little bit in the stressful stage of like getting workmen in to do the flooring and the kitchen and ordering and making decisions, like big furniture thing decisions. But the fun bit is gonna be the rugs, the lamps, the prints, what artwork I wanna put up at where, like. You might have already seen the announcement that I got the place on my Instagram at so sore. And I've been desperate to do a video on here to show you, but I needed the right moment when there was no workman here and I could come on my own and just sit down and chat to you and show you some things. Today is that day, so I'm really excited to get to finally talk to you and like share it and just be excited. The plan is that I'm gonna be moving in here and then at some point Bev's, my boyfriend, long distance boyfriend, will move in. Don't know when, it depends when the situations all line up, you know, he's gotta get a job here. He's got to be in a situation where, you know, he's ready to get all of his stuff to come down and all that, all that malarkey. So I want him to come visit and actually stay here as well before he moves, because I think, I think it'll be nicer for him to already have stayed here and know the place and know how it feels and picture himself here before he moves. It'll make it less nerve wracking maybe. I don't know, just a thought. But yeah, one thing I'm really excited about here is the filming aspect, because it's so quiet, which is just unbelievable to get somewhere like this because it's so, I'm always so scared. Like when I was looking at places, I'd, I'd always just be like, everyone like the real, the estate agent's silent for 10 minutes so I can listen, which I did do here. And I've been here loads of times now and I it is so quiet and I'm so excited because my dream is to be able to film ASMR during the day because then I can make more content, more ambitious content, have more time for like, projects and big art projects and you guys I've been working on the side on this business um these products that I'm working on as like a little side hobby slash business idea and I'm so excited about it and I can't wait to show you guys but I need more time to 
put focus on it, you know, alongside YouTube and alongside everything else that I'm doing. So I'm hoping that like moving here will give me so much more time because if I can film during the day, like at the minute I film my ASMR at like 10 p.m. till 2 a.m. and I just don't get that long. I have to do it when everyone's asleep and all that kind of stuff. But yeah. Oh my god, also, can I quickly show you how cute my outfit is? Because I just got a new skirt, and I never wear skirts, right? So, like, I don't think I've even worn a skirt since, like, school. I've never been, like, a skirty gal. Mainly because I hate, like, I'm all about comfort, right? And I always thought that in a skirt, when I've worn, like, a skirt and I sit down, it, like, rides up, or, you know, you have to be really careful here to sit down. This skirt, it, like, moulds to you because it's, like, a pleated skirt. So, however you sit down, it's comfortable, and I'm very excited about it, and I'm in love with it. I couldn't find anywhere to put you that's high up, so I'm just going to have to back up. <laughs> but look at this. I look at the boots, I feel like very like... I feel like for winter time, this is such a cute little vibe. Like I'm loving it. I got the skirt from the most unlikely place. I got it from um, Superdry. Do you, you remember the brand Superdry? I say remember like they've died. But I mean like I used to get Superdry stuff when I was in school. I never really got it once I was an adult because it just kind of went out of my circles of style, if that makes sense. But anyway, love this skirt, so cute and comfy. Okay, do I have any more updates? Okay, I could give you the dates that I think it should be done, in theory. <laughs> the, the thing is, you know, sometimes things take longer than you think they're gonna take and that the workmen think they're gonna take, so I have no idea 100%. But I'm getting the kitchen and stuff put in in December and maybe the bathrooms in January, maybe. So hopefully February, I won't say. Maybe everything will be done. Maybe I can move in. Who knows, we shall see. I'm excited, I'm so excited you guys. I'm so excited, I'm so excited. And I'm gonna take you on this journey, obviously. As I decorate things, as I buy things, we can go shopping together for things. I'm gonna take you on things. <sighs> it's just gonna be great, I'm just so excited. I also have plans to obviously vlog more. Once I've moved in here, and I have more time, hopefully I can vlog and chat and we can do things together with you. Thank you so much for watching. Um, I'm excited to take you on this adventure. It's also cool because I feel like these videos are like a diary of my life and the different things, you know, like I have when we moved into the place I'm in now with my parents, I have the vlogs from when I moved in there and it's nice just like for me to look back at over my life and see all the different moments. So this is the moment of excited Sophie because I just got my first place ever my own <laughs> anyway okay we'll speak to you guys soon goodbye